Welcome to Ari Jam 360 Caribbean News. I'm your host, Electro. For this news feature and more things Ari, download the Ari Jam 360 app for iPhone and Android devices. Follow us on social media. You can also visit arijam.com. In today's stories, Jamaican on 90 Day Fiancé. Vote for Dalton is a fake link. Sting and Shaggy tour resumes. Never ending number one on iTunes. And St. Mary Me Come From with big names. Jamaican featured on TLC's 90 Day Fiancé. TLC's 90 Day Fiancé, the hit reality show about couples who rush to the altar before their K-1 visas expire, is back for its sixth season and TLC released a trailer. In the sneak peek for season six, which premieres October 21 at 8 p.m. ET, fans are introduced to six foreigners looking to move to the U.S. to be with their American significant other, but are struggling to make their relationships work. Among the foreigners is a young Jamaican named Jay Smith who is either 20 or 21 and is seeking to cement his relationship with his blue-eyed bae, Ashley, who is 31. Jay met Ashley when she visited Jamaica for her friend's wedding. While out with her friends, the two met at a club. Ashley didn't expect to talk to him again, but Jay tracked her down on social media. Six months later, Ashley went back to visit, and after spending just eight days together, Jay proposed. Well, the outcome of this should be quite interesting. Dalton Harris says, Vote for Dalton is a fake link. 2010 Digital Rising Stars winner and X Factor hopeful Dalton Harris has hit out against individual soliciting votes on his behalf despite the fact that voting has not yet started in the competition. Harris took to social media to point out the scam. Greetings people, there is a link going around saying to vote for Dalton Harris in the X Factor. It is fake. Voting hasn't even started for anything in the show at all. The link is not true. It's a lie. Respect, he stated in the video. Dalton aced the audition with an impassioned performance of Elton John's Sorry Seems to be the Hardest Word, getting four yeses from the judges. He moved on to the Sixth Chair Challenge where he was again successful and is now part of the boys team, being mentored by English singer, songwriter and former One Director member Lewis Tomlinson. Dalton and his teammates were flown to the Sheik Island of Ibiza in the Mediterranean Sea off the eastern coast of Spain, where in an upcoming episode, they will be reduced from six to a team of four for the live shows. Sting and Shaggy Tour resumes. Shaggy and Sting's 44876 US tour suffered a setback because Sting was still recuperating from an illness. According to the British rocker, he was advised by doctors not to perform, stating that it has been very frustrating to be under the weather and out of action on doctor's orders over the past few days. Sting and Shaggy postponed two shows slated for the weekend. They encourage fans to hold on to their tickets until the dates are rescheduled. The 44876 tour resumed yesterday, Monday, October 15, in Los Angeles, California. Shaggy and Sting currently sit in the number one position on the Billboard Top Reggae Albums chart with their collaborative album, 44876. Barris's Never Ending is number one on iTunes. It seems to be a never-ending list of achievements for reggae legend Barris Hammond's newest album, which dropped last Friday. Taken to social media on Saturday, Barris thanked fans for making Never Ending soar to the top of the iTunes charts. He said, Number one iTunes reggae album US, UK, Japan. From the second it dropped at midnight, give thanks for the love and support, my family. In a subsequent post, he told his followers that CDs were sold out at Amazon, but promised that restock was on its way. In the meantime, fans can go to vpreggae.com for CD and vinyl. This is a good look for the maestro Barris Hammond. Did someone say a Grammy? Big names for a say Mirror Me Come From, Come A Town. The show is scheduled for November 10 at the National Arena and features a diverse entertainment lineup of new and seasoned reggae and dancehall artists, including Sister Carol, Coco T, Bongo Herman, Jan 9, Beanie Man, Chiching Ching, Popcorn, Shano, Ikea, among others. The That Day Will Come entertainer said, St. Mary means everything to me. It is women never string cut. He says the improved concept for a St. Mary Me Come From is exactly what he did after finishing school at Islington High School, now known as Horace Clark High School. That is, 
become a town. But he stressed that it did not necessarily mean it is moving away, but a way to create a bond between the two parishes. And that's how we wrap up for today. Thank you for watching Ari Jam 360 Caribbean News. For this news feature and more things Ari, download the Ari Jam 360 app for iPhone and Android devices. Follow us on social media. You can also visit arijam.com. See you soon.